Today, a Tampa police officer lost his life in the line of duty. August 19th is a day we remember Corporal Mike Roberts. Our Carson Chambers sat down with the police chief and with Roberts' close friends. August 19th was a tough day for some to get out of bed. I woke up today. I knew what the day was. I knew it was coming. Um, a day Tampa police officer day. Perry Anderson's been it's bracing for. It's going to bring back some memories. So, yeah. Anderson and other officers will retrace their steps tonight, the ones they took August 19th, one year ago in Sulphur Springs, when Corporal Mike Roberts was shot and killed. Anderson was on duty two blocks away, the first officer on scene and the first to give CPR. I was talking to him, trying to comfort him. The day is a tough one for Police Chief Jane Castor, too, but reminded me tougher for Roberts' loved ones. Mostly thinking about his family, you know, about his wife and son and, and mother that were left behind. August 19th brings back bad memories. I had just dropped my kids off the, uh, at their grandparents. I'd come from a family function, and I pulled in the driveway, and it was just something I was listening to the radio. And, you know, it was one of those, instead of turning off the call, it was just something about it. And they had called 1034, which is a, you know, check on the welfare, and uh, there was no answer. Replaying that night is a common thread. What Officer Lisa Parashas tries to think about is the good stuff. He wanted to get to know everybody, and he took an interest in your personal life, what your family was like. August 19th was a tough day to get out of bed, especially for those who are still reliving it one year later. And I just have to come to peace with it happened the way it happened, and that's... that's what we're going to have to live with. And we're live tonight in Tampa, right here on North Del Mabry, at a fundraiser for the fallen officers. We're at the Village Inn. It's a family-owned restaurant, and there's so many things that you could do if you stopped by. One of them is just to buy one of these T-shirts. Ten dollars. It goes to a good cause. You can drop off a check, a donation, or you can sit down and have a meal with your family. You're invited here until about 2 a.m. tonight. Live in Tampa, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News. Thank you so much, Carson. Well, the fundraiser runs until 2 a.m., so you still have plenty of time to get there if you'd like. The Village Inn is located at 215 North Del Mabry Highway. That's actually near the intersection of Kennedy Boulevard. And if you can't make it but you still want to help, head to our website, abcactionnews.com. You'll find a link inside the story on the main page with everything you need to know to help the families of officers David Curtis and Jeffrey Kokab.